So hey there everyone again. So I thought I would actually decorate this with you guys. I'm not sure if I'm gonna make a separate video or if I'll just put this one with the tutorial. So we so it will be all together, I'm not sure yet, but we'll see. Uh, so I actually also bought the ephemera pack from this collection. Uh, I don't let me just see if this is rip. I can take those in there so I can show you the back because this is a lot of pieces. I don't wanna go one by one. But you can see there it has really beautiful colors like pastel, pinks, yellow, soft yellows, really really cute. The phrases are in Spanish so I probably won't be using them unless I'm sending something to some Spanish uh, pen pal. But they are really really beautiful so I thought I would just make a tiny little cluster here in the cover. Let's just fill this out. I need to get a new package because this one is ripped. Things kept falling out. So I already I got this little doily thingy. I really love this uh, die. I really love this shape. It's one of my favorites. And I have a tiny wee ruffle here that I made with some garden party. I might use it or not. Let's see what I want to do. <laughs> Let's see. Not really sure what I'm gonna do. Let me just get some this up on because I still need to raise it up a little bit. I like to use that. Let's see, what do I want to use as my main focus? I really like these borders. I just don't like all the white borders. That really kind of... <laughs> annoys me. I like ephemera that doesn't really have this big white borders. I tend to fussy cut this out. I don't know why I don't really like it, but well, it's really pretty regardless. So let's see, what do I want to use? I normally choose what I want to use as my main focus, the piece that's gonna stand out and then I just build around it. Not really sure what I want to use in here. Ready to use the pretty bunny. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Thank you. Seriously, this song. Can someone come here and drill this song out of my head? Please. So annoying. I think I might want to use this hot air balloon. I think it's so cute. Maybe. Thank you. Oh god, seriously. This is really, really good paper. I really like the uh, the feel of this paper. This is from, I think this is Cartabella paper. Let's see. Uh, it's, this one here is really, really beautiful. And yeah, it's Cartabella. It's from the Flora number no. four collection. I got a bunch of the all these papers from this collection because Cartabella has really good paper. I really, really, really love the, the sturdiness of Cartabella's paper and they have like a really nice texture to it and she has all these beautiful fl florals. I really love this paper. It's really good to make uh, albums and boxes because it's, it's sturdier, it lasts more. This one is good paper too, but that one is really, really good. I really love that paper. So anyway, let's see. I have these cute hearts in here. Da -da 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 -da. Let's see. What should I do? What should I do with this? I don't like that. Thank you. Next. Thank you. Let's see how this video goes because, to be honest, I can be here like five minutes or I can be here half an hour. So you don't really want to see me 
struggle for half an hour so <laughs> I might not post this one at all okay that looks cute thank you next thank you I'm so fucking grateful for my ex I don't like that I don't like that I like the gold but I don't like that though I need something here, but I don't like this ruffle. Mm. I put um, a rosette. It's gonna get a little bit chunkier if I do, but let's just see. I don't like... Oh, wait. Maybe like that. Not too much. Actually, let's just... Put this thing up. I hope I'm in frame because I can't see the camera. <laughs> so I hope I'm in frame. I kind of like like that. It's cute. Yep. I think I like that. Looks nice. Do I still need something in here? Mm, I don't think I do. I put like a heart in here. Not too big. But I can get a smaller one to put inside the basket. Let's see, do I have a smaller heart punch? I think I do. Where are my heart punches? Heart, 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 heart. Yes. Heart, here. I do have a tinier one. So let me just real quick punch a tiny heart to see if I can put it in there. Yeah, I'm in front. I'm sorry, I lost my battery. My phone just died. So I just uh, had to put the charger on. See if we can finish this. So I, I cut the little heart and I'll put it in here. I'll I'll raise it a little bit. And I was thinking if I still need to put something like in here, but I I think I don't need to. I think it looks cute like this. I just need a sentiment. To put across and I think yeah I think I'll leave it like this I think it's cute let me just see what can I put in there mm. let me just maybe I can use some of this really studio words because the words from the the ephemera pack are in Spanish, but I don't think I'll be sending that to someone who speaks Spanish, so let's get some English. Mm, let's see. This one's pretty, but this will just fade into the background. This is too big. Let me just separate this so I don't mix the two collections. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. This is actually not the what I wanted. What is the other one? Where did I put it? I had the new camera pack from Rosie. It's a different one. It's a birthday theme one, but it has really cool appearance. It's this one that I was looking for. Let me just put this one back inside the package. This here. Lovely. It's too big. Okay. I think these colors, I think, will go better with this one. Mm. Some words, some words, some words. This is a birthday collection from Rosie Studio. It's really cute. I only got the ephemera though, but it's really, really cute. Oh, this is cute. Thinking of you. But it's too wavy. <laughs> I wish it was straighter. Oh, but I like the color. I think the color will look really cool in there. Let's see if I have something else. More or less in the same color. Sorry, I'm 
here to the side. Maybe the same one. Ah, that color was really cute, but why does it have to be so wavy? I'm weird like that. I don't like. Uh, oh, I don't have another one. Should I just <laughs> get over the waviness? Oh, I could put this one. Oh, yeah, I think this one looks cute. Hello. I can raise it up a little bit. Mm. Can I put it in there instead? Like, hello, and then thinking of you. Yeah, I think I'll do that. I'll just get over the waviness. <laughs> and plus, the, um, the coloring on the font, it's like exactly the color of the rosette. I think it looks cute. Yeah. Let's just do that. Let's not think more, or we might change it again. I think it looks pretty like this. Let me just stuck this inside or I'll be losing all these bits. I really like this pink leopard. I don't know, it's so cute. <laughs> Some really tiny tiny little pieces like tiny hearts and bows and the tiniest tiniest party hat okay oh shoot okay that's taken aside so let's just uh put this on but i didn't want to use the foam dot in here because hmm it will see through, so I think I might just, let's see if I can get a pretty flower that I can put in there. Let's see if I, wait, if I just do it like this, instead of a foam dot, I can put a flower. But it's too, it's too tall, this one, Let's see if I can find one that it's a little bit. Uh, they're all too tall. These are really pretty. These uh, were made by Cheryl. She sells this at her Etsy, Etsy shop. C.R. Ricard. I think. Gerard. Gerard. I think her name is Gerard, not Ricard. These are all too tall, but I didn't want to put a foam dot in there because it's gonna be... You can see it and I don't really like it. Let's see if I can find a tiny one somewhere. These are too big as well. Oh, maybe this one. Oh no! Oh, this one is tiny. Maybe this one will look good in here. Yeah, that one, that one. I got this really beautiful set of drawers filled with flowers that Cheryl sent me. She was so nice. So let's do this. I'll just put the flower in here. Let's see, put it more up top so you cannot really see her. But yeah, but it's prettier than a foam dot. And we'll do it like this. Yep, I like it. So let's just stick things out dun, dun, dun. and I'll use, where is it, here, I'll use my glue to put this on, let's put this one first, I'm using this one, see, it's from, ah, oh, it's from, oh, the brand is, I have no idea, it's a generic brand from Mi Tienda Darte, aka Craftelier, if you're outside of Spain and Portugal. This is actually where I got the the paper pad. I've been asked a lot where you can get this paper pad from Sami Gara, the Jane collection. And to be honest, outside of Europe, I have no idea where you can get it, but you can get it at her, uh, at Sami Gara's online shop. 
although shipping it a little expensive outside of Europe. But then there's the if you're in Europe, you can get it at Kimidori or Mi Tienda d'Arte or aka Craftillier or um, no, O Knife only you can get it on Spain and Portugal and the Baleares Islands for whatever reason. They don't really ship outside. And I don't know if this is a collection that you can find on scrapbook.com. Although a lot of the Spanish designers now are getting their collections sold outside of Europe. Like, um, what's his name? I know his name. Obed Marshall and Laura by Laura and Mintupia. You can all find those collections at uh, Frank Garcia's, I think, at... I don't know if scrapbook.com has it, but a lot of, I have seen uh, American crafters get it, so maybe this collection will also be available somewhere outside of Europe. It's a really pretty collection. I think they should sell it outside as well. Is this okay? Is this how it was? Mm, I think I should have put this flower a little bit towards the outside. It's okay like this. Let's just do this so I don't lose my spot again. Actually, I never, I didn't use to use glue a lot, especially this type of glue. But since I got this one, I've been really using it. I really like it. It dries, it, you have time to adjust your thingy, but it really, it's a good glue. Normally I would use this one because I like this thing where you can like spread the glue with. And this one is good as well, but I really like this one. Okay. Now I have glue all over my fingers because I had to take that little bit off. So let's try this one in here. Let's see. Dun, 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 dun. Like this. Yeah, let's put it in here. Again, let's just Put it like this so it doesn't move. Okay. Let's press it for a while. And now for the rosette, I will use my glue gun. I'm in frame because I can't see the camera. I hope I can put all the videos together because this is a mess. I might just do the tutorial and then the craft with me somewhat in a different video. I think that's that would be best. Oh, sorry. It's just the, the cord is on my way. Okay, so now let's see. I have to put the flower so you can't really see it much when you're watching from above. But uh, let's see. I think that in here it's okay. Like right there. I'm gonna make little dots so I know where to put it. And I'm gonna use my glue gun as well for this one. See, like this. Here, I hate the the little stringy things that the glue gun leaves all around. It's just annoying. I always have to be pulling them out. Okay, so now we'll put this in here like this. Not sure. Should I raise the hot balloon a little bit? No, it will be too bulky. Let's just do it like this. I think like this is already okay with the height of the flower and of the rosette. I'm gonna use my glue gun in this as well. Like this, like this. So let's just, I really like things to be really well stuck down. It's nothing worse than your project coming all undone, unraveling. It's really annoying. 
Okay, I think it looks cute. I really love these colors. It's so sweet. Cute. Now, let's see. Let's put. I seriously look at this. It's like, yeah, annoying. I'll put the heart in here. Actually, I'm not sure if I. Oh, let's just see. Let's put a little bit of foam in the back to raise it up and see what we think. God, seriously, I need a lobotomy to get this song out of my hair. Or my hair, silly. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing. I hope you can. Oh, dude. Like that. Let's just put a little bit of glue in there. Oh, come on. Thank you, next. <laughs> Thank you, next song, please. This is just driving me insane. Okay. Now, can I put this here? Because it has a hole in there, so... Will it look cool? Actually, I don't. I don't think I like it. I changed my mind. I don't like it. Especially because it doesn't stay, because obviously it has a hole in there. Let's just chuck it. I don't need that there. Let's just put this one, and this one I do have to raise it a little bit. So let's put some foam. This pink foam is really cool, because when you see it through the side, you just get the glimpse of the, the pink. And so it's cute, instead of the white from the foam dots, or if I put some chipboard. I really like this foam. Plus, because it's foam, it glues really nice. Like it's porous, I think, and the glue just stays there better. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah. Like on this side, and then a little bit. I don't think you are seeing what I'm doing right now. I need to push a little bit forward. I had to get a new scissors and one of these big ones because my other one it broke in here I have no idea how I broke the scissors it didn't fall I don't know how that happened and I got one for because I'm left-handed I got a scissors for left-handed people but I have never had a scissors for life <laughs> left-handed people I'm I'm used to using the right ones, and so I could not use it. <laughs> I just couldn't use it. It was so weird. I could not cut a straight line with that scissors. I just put it in a kitchen for general wear. <laughs> it's really weird. Okay, let's see. Because everything is made for right-handed people, I even the, the mouse on the computer I used it I use it with my right hand I don't use it with my left because when I learned how to use a computer it was at school I didn't have one for ages and they were all set up for right-handed people it's like those you know those uh, those desks those chairs that have the little desk they're always on the <laughs> on the right side for people who write on the right side so being left-handed and having to sit on those desks at school was really uncomfortable thankfully there were not a lot of classrooms who had that had those those normally it was just a desk and the normal chairs but those are really uncomfortable for left-handed people to to use but I guess this there are worse problems to have <laughs> up my thing and put back in there oh, I really like it I think it looks really cute these colors are so sweet I really love it and there you go let's see and then you open it up 
and you can decorate inside if you want as well but I'm not gonna I'm just gonna leave it like this I think it's cute like this I still have to cut this a little bit it's too long so and then this one as well let's cut this one a little bit as well let's try to put it in here side and there you go little cute file folder that you can use for whatever send some goodies in some fat mail and it's really simple to make uh, if I make a separate video I will link down below the video the link for the tutorial if not it would all be on the same so <laughs> And yeah, I hope you like this little video. I'm sorry it got cut. I My phone died. And yeah, hope everyone has a wonderful day. And bye-bye.